Welcome. Today I'm going to show you Math Flashcards by One Moxie Ventures. This is version 2.4.1 available today on the iTunes App Store. The first screen that loads is the selection screen for quizzes. You'll see that we already have four quizzes to find, one for addition, card 0 through 5 card values 0 through 5, subtraction, card values 0 through 12, division, card values 0 through 12, and multiplication, card values 0 through 5. We also show the last time and how well the student did. Five stars would be for 100% correct. And this one right here looks like it was four stars. The student missed one or more. And of course that's all proportional. Over here, we store the last fast time at 100% correct. So the last time that the student got 100% correct is stored here with the date. And that's really great. Kids love it. They can show their parents and show their friends and challenge their siblings. Taking a look inside uh, any one of these quizzes, we can define a new quiz or modify the existing one. You'll see that was 0 through 5 and bottom number 0 through 5 here. The operator up top is addition. It's really slick actually. You just tap this right here and you can increase the cards in the deck. So now I'm going to test 1 through 10 as the top values and I'll go ahead and make it 1 through 10 as the bottom values so we're comprehensive. But you don't have to do that. It's a very, very flexible program. Other options, we can shuffle the cards or we can provide them sequentially. We can offer multiple choice, uh, which would be the uh, four different um, uh, computer generated responses at the bottom of the card, which you'll see in a moment. Or turning that off would give us a keypad, which actually most educators believe to be a better mechanism to test and quiz with because it doesn't uh, provide a suggestion. We can redo missed cards, which is great for practicing. We reshuffle the cards into the back of the deck. We can try until correct as well, giving the, the learner a few chances to get the right answer. And then of course we can also limit the number of cards. Uh, so we can do all of course, which would be no limit. Uh, or 25, 50, or 100 cards per deck. And that's because if you are testing a wide range of values, you could have 600 cards in the deck and obviously that would be too many cards for any child to be expected to go through. But I will leave this at all, so we should have, uh, uh, that's uh, uh, 10 each, so 100 cards in this deck. And you'll see we have 100 cards in that. And By the way, the fast time gets cleared out whenever you modify the, uh, the deck, because it is going to be different. Um, moving on, we'll see that we have, uh, we're going to go ahead and take this first quiz, which was the uh, uh, 1 through 10 deck. We won't take the whole quiz, but we'll show you what it looks like. There's a card, as you can see, it's clean. It looks like a card, it is a card. It's what the kids are used to seeing. It shows us how many we have to go and what our elapsed time is. And we can go ahead and respond. If we make a mistake, you'll see we had redo until correct or try until correct on it. And we get a chance to get it right. That card will be presented again since we have uh, redo missed cards selected. I won't go through the whole deck, it'll take too long. I'd like to show you the option for keypads. Oh, there, multiple choice is off. So if we go into division, we'll see. Now we have the key and the answer. We can also, of course, swipe to move across, but that's not nearly as convenient as just tapping the next button. And that is Math Flashcards by One Moxie Ventures, available in the App Store, 99 cents. It's a very, very popular application, and uh, we'd love to have you as a customer. Have a great day.